vegetables have long been considered a health-giving food and our kelp is no exception. It comes from the clean waters of New Zealand, that's really important for kelp because some, kelp, some vegetables do absorb heavy metals from the ocean. Um, this is a very clean product, we've had it all tested. Uh, science has also recently shown that kelp has certain alginates in it that block the absorption of fats, so to those of you who want to be on a diet, that could be helpful information. Uh, there's also a lot of iodine in this product, an awful lot of iodine, which means a little goes a long way. The iodine helps to balance out the thyroid activity, which is part of the endocrine system, affects mood, weight, uh, and balance of energy within the body. So another good reason to take kelp. The final good reason is that it's a really good salt substitute. It's slightly salty tasting and um, it, it tastes great on tomatoes and fish. So what you're about to see is a short video from New Zealand about Roger and Nikki, our wonderful friends who harvest the kelp from the clean waters around Akara. Akaroa Harbour on Banks Peninsula has more than just rugged beauty. Its rocky shores and nutrient-rich tidal currents are perfect for kelp to flourish. Sea kelp thrives in rough waters where there's a fresh supply of nutrients. And in Akaroa Harbour, it grows very quickly. It's a renewable resource that's largely been ignored, but one man has seen its huge potential. Roger Beatty's been harvesting kelp for many years. So how did you get into seaweed? We were down here at the beach, my wife and I having a barbecue, and we'd, uh, I'd speared some fish on the, in the water just out here. And uh, we were cooking the fish, and we, there was some seaweed that was on the rocks, and we let it dry. It was a nice hot day. And then we rubbed it and crushed it on the fish, and uh, it was just wonderful. Roger has a permit to harvest four different types of kelp, he gathers it from near the Chatham Islands and also closer to home here in the Akaroa Harbour. Today he's gathering giant kelp, which grows in abundance here. Spring and winter are the best times to harvest as the kelp grows faster when the waters cool. Giant kelp floats on the water's surface like a mat and today's calm, settled waters are perfect harvest conditions. Roger's been collecting it for 20 years. The kelp's growth rate would amaze any land-based farmer. Well, it grows up to about a metre a day in really good conditions, and it grows from the tip. Uh, the little bits grow and then they, they break off, they separate off, and then it, the, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And that tip, that part there, might only be a day's growth. It's amazing how fast this grows. This is New Zealand's fastest growing plant. The kelp grows so fast that sustainability is not a problem. A morning's work will be enough to fill all the barrels on the barge. Later, Roger will dry the kelp and sell it as a food condiment high in iodine and other trace elements. It's a resource he believes is underutilised. Harvesting the kelp is only the first step it now goes to Christchurch for processing. Through years of practice, Roger has developed his own drying method where the kelp is hung on specially made racks. It looks simple enough, but Roger is meticulous about his method. We dry it outside uh, until it's semi-dried, about probably 30 to 50% moisture. It's really critical that we don't overcook it. And we dry it outside for two reasons. One is to get a bit of UV on it, as a sterilisation thing. The other one is it cuts down the costs. And what we're trying to replicate is a nor'west wind. What nature does normally, and we slow dry it at under 30 degrees so that we don't cook the goodness out of it. So it retains both the colour, the taste and the texture, and all the goodness. After the kelp's dried, it'll be ready for packaging. First, they crush it and sieve it into different grades and sizes. This new machine has replaced a much slower hand sieving method, 
It also means they'll be able to process larger amounts for future export orders. Thank you.